what is a limit? A limit is the value that a function approaches. Keyword there is approaches. It's not about the value at a point. It's about the value you get near the point. Let's look at an example. Suppose we have these x and y axes and this function f of x. You can see it's got a hole in it. Now what happens when x equals a? That's where that hole is. So what does f of x get close to? There. What does it get close to? Well, the answer is the limit. So the limit as x approaches a of the function f of x, we call it l. So l is the limit. So a function might be missing a point, or it might be defined differently at the point, and limits allow us to ignore that. Now we can look at the left and the right limits. So as we approach that hole from the left and the right, just intuitively, there's some more stuff that goes into it, but we can say that both sides, if both sides approach the same value, like they appear to in our example, they appear to both approach that little circle there, that missing value. Then, if both sides approach the same value, then the limit exists. Now again, we're not talking about the value of the function at the point, but near the point, as we approach the point. So why does this stuff matter? It allows us to predict behavior and also understand the smoothness of functions. It's also the foundation of derivatives. I know everyone loves de derivatives. And later, it's going to help us talk about instantaneous speed and slopes. All right, hope that helps. Thanks for watching.